Hello and welcome to Ministry of JavaScript. In this video, we are going to be looking at spread operators. So basically, we do use spread operators on two things. The first one is objects and the second one is arrays. Right. So uh, if I come over here and write console.log triple dot arr, then as you can see that it is returning me the element separately in, a, in an argument form. And this is equal to console.log one you know one two three four five so basically this triple dot arr is equal to this right so we do use spread operators whenever we want to you know clone an array or clone an object let me show you how can we clone an array so const arr2 and inside arr2 what i want i want all the elements of this arr array so I can come over here and write triple dot arr and if I console dot lock arr2 then you can notice that we are getting one two three four five and if I want to add some more elements you know six seven eight nine then we can also receive this when we are consoling lock arr2 same is the case with object if I come over here and I create a new object and what I want I want all the properties of obj then I can do something like this console.log obj2 then as you can see we are getting name david and h30 and if I want to add new properties like status equal to false then as you can see that uh, status was, has also been reflected so this is how you can work with the spread operators i will see you in the next video have a nice day